Hey YouTube, uh, I'm absolutely excited to show you my latest purchase. Uh, I've been teasing you a little bit on Instagram uh, and also mentioning in my some of my other videos. So here it is. So the watch comes in the traditional uh, Rolex box, the cream one and the outer box. Uh, and then you've got the wooden green, green box uh, with the wave pattern in the top. Uh, and for dramatic effect, slowly opening the box. There you go. It's an absolutely beautiful piece. So just taking out the box. The symmetry is superb. That smooth bezel. Very, very understated. So it's a watch you can wear with a pair of jeans or uh, wear with a suit. Um, you can swatch, uh, swap out the... Uh, the bracelet for you know a NATO strap um, the just the understated look is I, I just love it I know a lot of people think it's a it's a boring watch but I think it's just elegant um, there you can see on the back it's got the oyster safety clasp so you know it's not going anywhere um, so you kind of uh, lock it, it it closes and then there's a kind of safety clasp at the, on the on the back it doesn't have the glide lock but it does have the uh, easy link uh, extension so just uh, a couple of things about this so it's got the twin lock uh, and 100 meter uh, water resistance um, it's got the parachrome hairspring and the paraflex shock absorbers um, 40 hour power reserve uh, and uh, you know it's got loom on the Arabic uh, numerals uh, what else comes in the box so you can see that it's got the uh, I've kept the receipt in there. It's got the um, kind of manual. Uh, I don't know anyone. I don't know if anyone actually reads these manuals, but <laughs> it's kind of nice to just flick through them now and again um, when you're unboxing. Uh, get then you've got the kind of the leather pouch uh, with the uh, your warranty card uh, and also the guarantee kind of service uh, booklet that comes with it. Uh, I had to have a couple of uh, links taken out and I just left them in, in, the, in the box there. So why did I go for this? Um, when I was buying my Submariner, um, this was one of the things I was looking at at the same time. I just couldn't make my mind up. And at the time I, I went for the Submariner, but all the while thinking I would really like to, I really like the Explorer. Uh, and then when I was able to, I, I um, and one became available because even these are on the waiting list. You know, it could take a month or, or more to get hold of one of these. And finally, when one became available, uh, I pulled the trigger. Um, so yet to kind of wear it yet. Uh, and you can see I'm wearing the uh, Submariner. Please like and subscribe as usual um, and add your comments below. It really means an awful lot to me. Thank you and hope to see you at the next one.